Hi guys, we're back here in Beaverstown and uh, we're starting on the 10th today and as per usual I'm stuck with Ed Martin Hi guys And uh, we're going to see how we go for the next few holes Hope you enjoy it, cheers guys Here we go with the legend Ed Martin, driver on 10 uh, 386 meter par 4 out of the chute Let's see what the legend's got Oh, not as good as you'd like, but good enough, good enough. Go gently now, go gently. First shot in a while. Oh, and he's pulled it. Oh, timber. It's the trouble with this place. There's trees everywhere I hit the ball. 165, one, 180. Yeah, we go Slightly uphill, flat cam, just to give you an idea. It's up there. Back to the legend. Ed Martin, 5 iron. After hitting that thing straight at the feckin' flag. Yeah, when he says short, front half of the green. All the way back, yeah? All the way back. Strike. Short. Can be barely on the middle. The front half. Oh, middle the front half. What can you do? So today we're doing a vlog. Uh, we've been told to call it that because Ed's brother Rob says it's not a vlog. It's not a video log. It's a vlog. So we're doing a vlog today. This was right up Ed Street. Oh, and he's duffed it. He's duffed it. Yeah. Shocker. He's left it a foot short. Uphill to the hole, downhill past the hole. You wouldn't like it too easy. Take that though, you take that. You take that. Okay, so we're on number 11, 182 yard par 3, and the flag is tucked right behind that bunker. Let's see if we can get a look at it. Yeah, sort of. Just behind the middle of the bunker. Five iron, Eddie? Five iron? Five iron, she is. Might have a baby cut on it. Yeah, I might not have enough stick if, if he's got five. Missed on the fringe just right. Stephen's too stubborn to change his club, so <laughs> watch out for smoke and jumping out of the shoulders. Eh? Shoes could be coming off here. Look, look out for me hitting the left side of the green. Short and left is a definite possibility. Oh, he's dinned it. That's a beautiful golf shot, first to the green. Come on. Yeah, Ed left himself straightforward enough little chip. I expect a man of his talent to put it close. Uh, slides to close. Oh, 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 a bit of meat left on that bone. We'll see that one in. Okay, on the 11th green, Stephen has got a bit of a, he's a bit left, bit of a left and right, I think. A little bit of work. Happily, Ed has not put the pressure on me. See, can we get a whole lot in there? No. He's that far away. Not the worst punch you've ever seen. Come on, you little beauty. Yeah, it's left himself about five foot. Slippy enough. I think a man of his talent, though. 
shouldn't be an issue. If in doubt, hit it straight. That's what they say. Uh, but how many times do you hit it straight is the question. Dirty little four. Well, I expect a better from a talent like Ed Martin. Okay, number 12. Short enough par four. Ditch in front, tight green. Stephen is going with three wood. No tee, because he's a pro. Able to strike it clean. Oh, yeah. about legendary he here. Could duff this one off the tee. He says it's a beauty. We, on the other hand, have no idea. Skinny little power forward, all right. Ed taking, uh, would this be a uh, two iron, Edward? This would be Ed's favourite now. I expect a nice shot here. 321 meter power four. Tight though. He's picking up his tea quickly. I assume the marshals have found it. He's happy. So here we are, day after the Irish Open. Rory has thrilled the home fans by eating up the last two par fives. For you, Ed, what was your highlight of it? My highlight was uh, definitely 16. McElroy's second shot at the 16. That tight green, uh, one behind. That was a serious shot with, ten, with a ten, about a 10 minute wait in those cold weather. Yeah, do you reckon Great the shot. weight made a difference for a player at his level, yeah? I do, I definitely do, yeah. Um, he can get cold. Standing around, and all the time to think about his one shot lead. There's a lot of trouble around that hole. Well, one shot behind he, at that stage. Yeah. He, he can't be missing that green um, left or right, and he's dead in that situation. So. Yeah, and it's a good two shot. put to follow as well, in it's fairness to him as well. Uh, it wasn't easy coming down the the slope no, and across two, the break. Two put and, it in. Yeah, solid. Um, solid. Par from Russell Knox made par, and he gets that's a bogey even. Bogey, yeah, he three put it from lead. nearly the same spot. Oh, massive turn of uh, points. I can't remember, did Danny, Will, good, but did Danny Willett two or three put from there as well? Uh, don't remember that now. I think Danny three put as well. I think Knox and Willett both three putted and Rory got down in two. So, yeah, a good two put to follow and a greater uh, wood into the green. 16 for me was definitely a shot of the day. So, up here on the 12th, just off the fairway, Stephen's lie. Beauty. It's the carry this. Ditch and the bunker. 152 to the flag. 152, Yarr. he tells us. Yarr. I think I'm going to get the ditch. Um, Tight green. We'll take the green, absolutely. Absolutely. Ball below feet, heavy lie. Yeah. One's going to cancel out the other a little bit. Just try and get a half decent strike, that little thing. By the way, my arse was not a good side to no. get, but we won't go there. Probably not. <laughs> That's where we're going with Steve. Take it easy, boy. Take it easy. And leak the fraction. Where are we? Did he? It'll be okay. Okay, on the right edge. How are you going with it? 142. I'm going with 9. Very picturesque little nine. hole here. You can see the, how the trees trim in on each side. The river just short of that bunker. Not in play for a man of Ed's ability. Flag is back right edge of the green. It's like being in Augusta. Only he's leaked it out to the right. A one armed finish. Hi, hello, Stephen. Oh, we're going to go low. We're going to go low. Quite low. picturesque here with all the. The apple trees and the cherry the trees blossoms around, out yeah. on them. Very pretty. Cherry blossoms have all kind of fallen at this stage. That's good. That's not getting up there. Not getting up the hill though. Oh, hit it, young man. Hit it now. Did he say young man? <laughs> I just gotta leave it at that. Oh, easy go. Now I'm going to do my, my um, artistic thing, hiding in the trees while Ed there. plays this one. Got a good light. No green. He's very fussy about these things. He wants everything. He wants a good lie, loads of green to work with. Oh, he's going for the pop up. Oh, he pops oh, it up him. beautifully. Beautifully. How close has that gone, Eddie? That's maybe 
three, four. You won't take a breath. I'm sure that's three, four. But well, we'll see. Very artistic now. <laughs> <laughs> sit down while we get a worm's eye view of this one. Yeah. The difficulty could be getting them back up off the ground though. <laughs> Just slightly off the right, me thinks. Oh, jumped in the air. Ah. Oh, need tried to come back in there. Just missed. been a long delay between videos now um, <laughs> we have had to get Ed up off the ground it's been a challenge oh he's on his way back down again this could be fatal so he's got a nice little uh, three and a half four foot I would have said to win the hole a break on it. little bit of movement left edge. just go one up me thinks Oh, oh, he's disappointed. I can see it in that pretty little face. <laughs>